Hey everybody, and welcome back to another episode of the Terraforma Craft Let's Play here. Ho -ho. So right now, um, I am just wandering around trying to find traces of the uh, silver and uh, whatever else I needed to make bronze and uh, tin. I am trying to find silver and tin right now. And actually, I forgot, what was the name of that of that tin ore. Forgot what it was called. Calciterite. Okay, yeah, I haven't found that. So I'm trying to find sil traces of silver and uh, tin right now. So far, no luck. Um, I, c I find uh, sometimes uh, looking for ores very annoying. <laughs> but that's part of the uh, f that's part of the game. But yeah, right now I'm just wandering around the world. <clears throat> uh oh. Trying to find uh, the, the ores that we need here to make the other bronzes. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. And once I'm done with that, I'll be back once I hopefully find something. Hopefully soon I find something. Alright, we found something here. Uh, I don't think this is... Sphalerite. I don't think I need Sphalerite. I, need, I needed uh, Calciterite. Yeah, tin. And then I needed, uh, for the black bronze, I need... It's literally just called silver. I have I have copper, so we're we, we're good on that stuff. I just wanted to get this, see what this is. Oh yeah, I have a lot of that back at the base. So yeah, by the way, I found a marble. Got marble now, which is pretty cool. So I might as well put that on the list real quick. All right, perfect. Back to the exploration here. Looks like we are coming into a savanna type biome. So we got some baobab trees here and by the way uh eventually in a future update of minecraft these will actually be in vanilla baobab trees so these look really really cool what is this here ah uh, i don't want sphalerite i want freaking cows right oh this is so annoying but yeah i wanted to show the trees here all right i just found some zebras over here look at that this is my first time ever seeing zebras Whoa, this is cool. I believe you can't ride them or anything, so that kind of, that kind of, that's a bummer. But look at these guys. Look at these zebras. Wow, these look awesome. This might be the thumbnail for today's episode. Maybe, we'll see. Oh, we got a thumbnail just in case. Look at that. Zebras. All right, I found some kind of a fruit here. I'm not sure what this is, and they're not ripe to pick yet, so I'll have to come back over here sometime and find these similar-looking trees so I can find out what this is. Um, if anyone knows what this is, I would love to know, because this is interesting. Oh, and it's almost time to go to bed. Man, look how tall that tree is. That thing is really tall. Wow. I've never seen one that tall before. Interesting. Oh, and by the way, I found some poor... Uh, it's a hedrite right over there, like a whole bunch of it. So that is something I can go back to if I ever need that. Alright, so I found more copper. So this is awesome. We got this. What quality is this? Oh yeah, I forgot to do that. I found uh, more gooseberry bushes. Where was this? Rich? Wow! And I believe, and if I believe so, that this is uh, copper. So, wow, this is, okay, we're gonna, this is definitely a place we're gonna have to come back to. Man, I love when I find, uh, ores, like, sticking right out in the open like this. They're just really easy to grab and get to. So, let's mark this on the, uh, list, shall we? I heard some gravel fall or dirt fall. So, yeah, um, I'm, I've been traveling for quite a bit here, and it's starting to really annoy me how, uh, how long this has been taking me to do, <laughs> to be honest. And let's actually put this in there. And do I have any more of these? Yeah, I have more jars. Thankfully, I kept all these, kept these all these jars on me because I actually forgot to grab uh, more uh, vessels. But yeah, I'm gonna keep going here. I, I I'm not gonna stop until I try to find some more. Uh, find the silver, and uh, I wanna try to find both of them today, but. I'm gonna have to cut a lot of this stuff out of this episode today just because I really, really wanna 
get the uh, find this stuff so we can get that bronze making today. And I actually want to do some building today too. So because I've been getting some comments of saying that uh, they wanted to see some more building and stuff. So I will try to fit that in this episode. And we'll probably do some more work on the uh, the water wheel. And before I'm going to do that, work on that, I'm going to show you that image of it before I start working on it when we're back at the base. But I'm going to keep on trekking here, see if I can find any more stuff. All right, I found some other ore called, uh, what was it called? Uh, Kaloronite? I don't know. I'm not sure what this stuff is used for, but I found this. So this is pretty awesome. So I'm going to mark this down. I don't, I, I, I'm pretty sure there are some ores that are useless in this. I'm pretty sure. I don't know. Make it like some kind of like a pink color, I guess. Ooh, there we go. Let's we'll leave it like that. All right, perfect. I'm I'm away. I'm a lot closer to the base now. I decided to go back to these huge mountains that I live uh, by because there's some pretty big mountains here, and, I, and there's a quite a bit of stuff over here that I have found over here a while ago and just hadn't like uh, marked up or anything yet. So I figured, why not come by over here? And there's a bunch of kill. Uh, copper that I found over here too that I forgot about. I think this is cool, right? Oh, that's tetrahedrite. There's so much of tetra that's tetrahedrite stuff. A uh, bag right over where the uh, savanna was when I was all the way over there. There was so much over there, and I guess what I, I kept finding that. So I'm like, all right, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna head back to uh, the mountains near my place because I there's so much stuff here that I have found with the uh, prospectors pick here. Um, but yeah, um. This is taking a lot longer than I was hoping for. It's getting kind of annoying, but I'm going to try to keep finding the stuff here. Oh my god, I just killed a wither skeleton. And uh, he just dropped some bear fur boots. Wow. That was pretty awesome. Oh, and by the way, I finally found some freaking... Uh, silver, sur both surface finds, thank god they were both surface finds. That took so long, man. That was, I was about to quit, honestly, and try to do that another time, but I'm like, I really wanted to get it done this episode. And, believe it or not, I ended up finding it around the, uh, huge uh, mountain area over here, which was awesome. And I'm really happy I went over here, because there's so much over here. So I also found a huge sample of, uh, I haven't dug to it yet, but I found a huge sample of gypsum. And I found, I never told you about this, I found a uh, lapis over by the savanna area as well. So I have that over there too to uh, get some time. I haven't found, I don't know what, I think cinnabar was a uh, redstone. I haven't found any c cinnabar yet, uh, sadly. But is this like, no, I can't drink that water. But yeah, I want to show you what I got. Both surface finds, thankfully. And yeah, oh, and I got some more of the, I found, there's more calciterite. <clears throat> Over here too that I found a while ago. I forgot where I marked it. Yeah, right there. I was a I found that a while ago, and I found more rich. And I didn't. And that's actually more in underground. So luckily, but for the the cassiterite in the native, I mean the silver. I didn't know you could find rich uh, sources of. Uh, oh yeah, I got for the calciterite. I just got. I found a, a regular, but for the silver, I was surprised to find. Um, Rich and I didn't know I didn't know you could find a uh, rich uh, ores on the surface. I thought that was really interesting Okay, so after uh, doing some like calculations in my head. I don't know if this is right, but this should make black Bronze this should make that and I'm so happy and lucky that I ended up finding some native gold nuggets around the area too as I was walking around that worked out perfectly all right, so we're gonna put these guys in the pit and let's get them smelted up real quick, shall we? Gotta just chop down some trees real quick. Cause I don't I'm always out of trees. Alright, I'm gonna chop down one of these really big trees here. Oh, that would kill that guy. Perfect. We got four experience points, not bad. Alright, we're gonna chop down this tree. I think this is an oak tree? But yeah, look how thick that log is. That's pretty big. That's a big tree. All right, here we go. Let's see. This is probably oak. I think this is oak. Whoa! Yep, that's oak. Man, I'm gonna plant. I need to plant more oak down because I love oak. 
All right, with finally that done, I just uh, cooked up the uh, the pit kiln right there. So hopefully those work, and I get the uh, bronze and black bronze. Oh, think speaking of that, I want to. I need to get the uh, the uh, the ingot molds before I forget that. Uh, I don't want to forget that. That'd be that'd be disastrous. If I forgot that. But um, as that is smelting, let's do some little. Let's do some building on the. Uh, the water mill building. So let's get that started up here, over here real quick. Um, I made some more of those dolomite bricks, so we can build up the uh, bottom layer of the uh, of the mill. Because in real, just like real life, you put if you were building something in the water, you'd put stones as the base, and then you would use uh, wood as the uh, secondary part. So I think we can actually cover this whole. Actually, no. Let's keep that open up so we can get the water flowing in here and then we'll put a layer of rock right here oh it's getting dark of course it is all right let's just finish this up real quick I always get so nervous to see if the uh, ingots or uh, the um, metals, the alloys that I smelt together working or not. Uh, watch them not work again. The uh, the brass sh or the regular bronze should work. The bronze should work, the regular one. So let's see how it goes in the morning. Fingers crossed they both work. Oh my goodness, I hope they both work out perfectly. I have so much junk in my inventory though. Look at all this junk. Oh my goodness. Please, 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 please work. Please work. Oh my gosh, I got, I'm nervous right now. Ah, black bronze didn't work. Of course it didn't. Bronze! Yay! The bronze worked. Fantastic. All right, we got one of the uh, alloys that I wanted to work, so that's good. We got bronze now, so that's fantastic. Now we just need to get the black bronze to work, and then we should be good for uh, for to make the uh, the bloomery, and then we'll have to uh, put in the sheets together and all that stuff. But I'm gonna collect the rest of this uh, bronze here, and then I'm gonna try again to f find another video or something to make the black bronze, because that's the last thing we need. Then I can make the bloom. Then I can uh, try to mold these uh, ingots together so we can make the sheets to make the bloomery, and then we'll set up the bloomery in the next episode with some more building, of course. All right, it seems like uh, the uh, the one of our chickens here got loose. I don't know why. Oh, why is he going through the ground? Oh my goodness. Okay, let's get him back. He get, apparently accidentally left the uh, little safety gate over here open. And look, we got a little chick. We got a little chick, mm -hmm. which is awesome. But we need to get this this uh, hen back into the uh, into the sty here. So let's try to get him over here. And I and I think I found a. Better, uh, I think I fixed up the uh, the black uh, bronze recipe here. So let's see if that's if it will work now, and we can get back to the build. Uh, let's see. Oh man. <laughs> All right, let's cook this up. All right, and of course I got all the annoying particles around me. All right, perfect. All right, let's go back to the uh, the water mill. So I'm going to show you a picture of it right now. Hopefully I find that picture. But if I don't have it, uh, I will have it. Don't worry. You'll be able to see it. Um, oh, I got large oak logs. Can I actually use this as a side thing? Oh, my gosh, I can. We're going to do that. It's going to look vanilla, but I don't care. Um, let's do this. All right. Oh, God, I almost fell into the water. Large log. Didn't I use large logs for the barn? No, I didn't. I used the individual ones all right perfect um i think we can go up one more block on each side i'm not going to use the sycamore for the main log it's probably going to be oak all right let's just build up one more block per pillar on the side on the edges here all right you know i should actually pull up the picture of the mill as i'm building this so i can make sure i'm doing this correctly so i'll be back in one sec Okay, uh, this picture that I have found here is really cool because it shows you that also the interior and shows how it, it works, which is really cool and fascinating. So um, we're going to go ahead and go through this picture. So it looks like it doesn't have these pillars. 
Um, so let's actually take these out then, and that's actually I'm fine with that because then I can I get more wood out of this out of these blocks anyways. And I think the oak will actually work out perfectly with the color of the uh, actual with the picture of the water mill. So that's excellent. So you gotta have like a little uh, back. It looks looks like there's like a little smaller like room in the back behind it so we will actually end up putting one right here then so we'll put that here and two blocks on the side so we'll put another one right here and i need to get my stone shovel so we can dig this out a little better here so we'll go out like four blocks yeah we'll go out four blocks perfect and then we'll have like the little doorway right there and we'll make this slightly We'll just make this go up one block uh, higher from the uh, actual building. And it's getting dark, so let's go to sleep real quick. All right, good morning. Let's see if the uh, auras worked. I highly doubt that the black bronze worked, but let's see. If, I, if it does, I'll be happy. I bet, I bet it's not. Oh my god, it worked. But I, got, I have less, but... All right, so I know what to do now. I had that other... Uh, I had it recorded so I can see what I did and how much I put in there. So we'll definitely put some... Oh, wow. I only had enough to get one ingot. But that can be fixed. Now it's just trying to get the uh, percentages right here. But all right. We got our first uh, black bronze here. So I'm going to quickly... Uh, let's quickly... I'm going to go back into my recording and see how much I put in there so I can try to get more out of this. So I'm going to do this real quick. Add the more resources or the ingredients to make the black bronze and then I shall be back all right I just put up the uh, the more black uh, bronze out on the uh, pit kiln so let's do a little bit more work here um, okay so let's do I gotta make some more uh, you gotta make some planks here oh look at that chopped oak log wow and then we need the lumber perfect and then we make the lumber into blocks that's 16 oak blocks, so let's see how we want to make this go up. Three blocks, I think, is a good height here for the uh, building. Oh my gosh, there's more blocks in here. I'm soaking wet now, but I don't care. I just wanted to get those blocks back. Yeah, I'm soaked. My socks and my pants are soaked, but I don't give a rip. All right, so we're going to do this. Perfect. And let's put up the build up the rest of the sides here. And for the roof, I am going to be making some more uh, tiled roofs, because the one in the built and the one in the picture is obviously uh, it's with tiled roof, so we'll use that. Oh well, let's just chop up the rest of this these logs, shall we? Oh, I meant to chop this up one more time. I saw it. I mean, saw it. There we go. Oh, look at that. We got a stack of oak planks. Wow. And vanilla would be like easy peasy lemon squeezy to get this amount, amount of uh, wood <laughs> or planks. All right. Two. Excellent. Got two up. I don't think you can build up two blocks. You can't. You can only do one. It makes sense to not uh, do two blocks. Oh, God. The stupid, I'm getting these like, I don't know why my frame rate is so bad. I have my render distance to like 6 right now. When I play vanilla, I have like no frame rate issues. But when I'm playing this, I have frame rate issues. It's really odd. Um, okay, let's see. Let's put up this last layer of oak logs. Or planks. Oh, we need more. This, this will... Hopefully, I don't know. This might be enough for both the little sh with the little building too. This is enough for sure for this. Uh oh, oh, well, that's too high. Stupid lag made me do that. Okay, cool. Let's just do one block. Let's just do yeah. Let's just do one height. One here. I think this will be good. I'm gonna need one more. Oh, where's my saw? 
Actually, actually, no, let's see, let's see how this is gonna look first. Let's do one more layer of uh, oak logs for this part. Huh. Let's do one more layer here. No, let's do one here first. Let's do here first. Okay, here we go. This is, yeah, this is, this is, this is better. And then what we're going to do here is have the water in here be, the, so the, the water wheels are still going to be underground. Um, so we'll have like a, the water here go into a waterfall uh, to go to the, uh, yeah, this is good. And then we'll have those go to the, uh, to the wheels to spin the wheels, of course. But for the outside exterior wise, we're going to just keep it like, we're going to do this, what we're doing right now. Okay, perfect. So then we're going to have to have some windows. And I forgot to put some uh, stuff here. We got to put some oak logs here. Wow, this thing ended up using a lot of oak logs or planks. Jeez. Okay, perfect. Let's do this. All right, and then we're going to need windows. This thing has windows, of course. So we'll have one window here. We're going to make some uh, glass uh, blocks or glass panes or whatever. We'll have one there, one here. Actually, not one here. Just one like that. This is I'm I'm looking at the wrong side of the building in the picture. Okay, then we're gonna have a window. I need to get up here. We're gonna have one window right right here, and another one right here. And we'll do the same on this side. One here. And one there. Woo! Alright. Perfect. And then next, I have to... Uh, I need to get that one plank that's in the window seal over here. There we go. All right, so the next step would be to get the glass. Maybe we make a door. So let's make a let's make a chestnut door. Perfect, and we'll put that. We'll use these stone. I need to get that. Where's that? Where's that shovel that I had made? Let's get that stone shovel. I need to make some more uh, bismuth. Uh, <clears throat> Some bismuth bronze uh, tools. Luckily, I have a lot of ingots, so I can make uh, some more, some more tools. I need to make a new prospector's pick and eventually an axe too. But luckily, it's nice not having to worry about uh, not having any resources to make a new ones for my tool. I'm making new tools, so that's good. I can make new tools and not have to worry about not having enough stuff right now. All right, let's just dig out the floor here, the dirt floor. Perfect. Get these sleeves out of the way. Oh, I'm getting thirsty. It's always something. And it's annoying too when you're thirsty and stuff because you get all the, or hungry, because you get all those little particle effects and it gets in the way and it's annoying. Uh, let's eat some cooked pork chops and get that out of the way too. Perfect. All right, let's put in these. Hopefully this is enough. I doubt this this is not enough. Nope. We'll just put uh, some wood in the ground, I guess. There we go. <laughs> we'll put the door here. All right, and then we need to get some more. And we're going to put another window here, right here, too. Perfect. And we'll put another window here. Another one here and on the other side too, the exact same spots. Woo! That lag, man. And then one here. All right. So next episode, will the next step will be to make the uh, glass blocks. We'll do that in the next episode, and also uh, make the more more tiled make some tiled roofs here, so we can get some of that going on there. We need to put some candles in there. So luckily, we have candles. Last episode, we made the candles. Did the candles go out? Did they go out over time? I guess they do. Well, that makes sense. Yeah, there we go. Let's light up those back. Beautiful. All right, perfect. 
Um, let's see. The bismuth is that? Is it done smelting? Oh, it's done. Okay, let's see if it's gonna work. I, I doubt it's gonna work. Oh wow, it did work. Okay, I got I got uh three hundred this time. Oh yeah, let's put this one in there. Perfect. And we got three. We got four bars in total. And how many uh? How many was it that I needed to make the double sheets? Oh, that was so close. Son of a gun. All right, let's see how much more I need. How many sheets? Of, oh, I, I need... Oh, I need three sheets of double... Oh. Of double sheets? Right? Oh, man, that sucks. Oh, oh man, so I'm going to have, like... Enough for, uh... Oh, no, 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 no. I can use two. Two, two of them. All right. So we need how many... How many uh, does it to make two? I thought I saw one with two uh, black steel. Black, uh, black bronze. Mm. Yeah, there's one with two. Okay, cool. So I need two... Mm ingots to make a double a double bronze ingot or an ingot and then I need two sheets okay yeah I, need, I think I need two I need uh, four more I need four more of that so I'll do that here off camera I'll make some more uh, ingots here and then once you get back I'll come back with all the ingots that I need because I want to end this episode making the bloomery for sure and next episode we'll do some more building more work to the uh to the uh, water mill that's for sure and we'll get that uh underway so yeah i'm gonna go get some more materials for the uh ingots to make more ingots and then when i once i come back i'll meet you in here and we shall uh or i'm gonna start uh combining the uh ingots here so we can finally make that damn bloomery because that needs to get done man in the next episode we'll set it up A little uh, update here. Just finished making the uh, the double bronze sheets, so now I got all the double bronze sheets that I need, and I also got all the, of course, the uh, the uh, black uh, bronze that I need. So I just need to make uh, two double bronze sheets of black bronze, and then of course we have all the uh, bismuth bronze sheets that I made the last episode and uh, well, as soon as I'm done with this we should make the bloomery and then we should call it an episode for the day so next episode we'll set up the bloomery and then we can hopefully get started working on some iron all right just finishing I apparently I didn't make a double bronze uh, sheeted uh, bismuth bronze stuff and I just quickly did that so now we should have everything I need to make the uh, bloomery, which is very exciting. This is the first time I've ever done this, so let's do this. Just place it. I don't think it really matters how you put it in. It just says put it in. Oh my god, there we go. Bloomery, baby. Oh, baby. And so now we can uh, make uh, iron. So we can make iron so we can get iron tools. And then we can get... Uh, so I can finally make the... Uh, also the... Uh, gosh darn it the water wheel for our water mill so that's very very exciting here we go let's get some water so i think that is a perfect place to end this episode and i just ran out of food too so um next episode like i said we're going to work on the set up the bloomery so we can get that going why can't i move forward there we go um we'll set the bloomery up and then we'll make the glass uh panes or glass blocks i don't know which I'm going to use yet yeah, maybe probably glass panes cause I think it would look better but yeah so we can get some more work done on the uh, on the water mill but yeah guys I hope you've enjoyed this episode this episode took a lot of time to make um, just trying to get find all that the the castellarite and the uh, silver that took so freaking long to do it probably took me at least two hours just to try to find all that stuff which was a pain in the butt but I'm so happy that's done because now we've got the bloomery which is exciting and awesome. So I hope you've enjoyed this episode, everybody. And I hope to see you in the next one, everybody. Take care, everybody. See you later. Bye-bye.